Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to Stuff and Things. I'm Dan. And I'm Mia. And this is our daily news show where we bring you stories from Canada and the world. In 2011, nine-year-old Rachel Beckwith was raising funds to provide clean drinking water for a village in Africa. Before she could reach her $300 goal, she was a victim in a 13-car pileup near her Bellevue, Washington home. The outpouring of generosity from this event caused a massive surge in donations, reaching over $1.2 million. One year later, her mother Samantha has visited a few villages to see the work her daughter's campaign has done. She found the visit easier than she thought it would be, seeing all the good to come out of that tragic event helped her deal with the pain. Several villages will now have access to clean water thanks to all of the support Rachel's family has received. When Samantha visited one village that had already got the well set up from the campaign, she was greeted by a parade and parties, well-wishers, and even got to plant a tree in a park that has been named after her daughter. The generosity that Rachel expressed at such a young age did not even originally come from her parents. Even at kindergarten, she was constantly expressing support and empathy to every person in need. One can only imagine the good this little girl could have done for the world if given the chance. And if only the amazing support shown for her cause could have come without such a high price. Now her family is continuing to raise funds in her honor and I think she will always remain as a standard for what a person can only hope to be. But do you think that this generosity should only be triggered in light of such a tragedy? Let us know in the comments down below. And if you've liked what you've seen today, don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button. And we'll see you tomorrow.